Okay, so we are staying in the resort called The Fern uh, in Savai Madhepur, Ranantampur. Uh, as the name indicates, the property is pretty big and you can see lots and lots of fern plants around, full and full of greenery. Um, so now I am going to uh, take you to the restaurant uh, because we are going to go for a dinner. Let's see what they've got. Um, the best thing here is uh, you have got two options. One, uh, either you can opt for the buffet meal um, while you're booking itself or you can also book it separately. Shouldn't be a problem for that. Um, so you can either go for buffet meal which will be cost you somewhere close to 650 rupees per person or you also have an option to opt for the a la carte menu. So we have an a la carte menu where you have all the dishes, whichever you prefer dishes, you can just go ahead and uh, you know, uh, order it. So let me take you inside the restaurant. Let me show you what they've got for the buffet. Okay, what kind of dishes they have got. Uh, the buffet has got one non-vegetarian dish, the rest all is going to be a vegetarian dish. So let's go into the restaurant and see. They have got a pretty decent setup, uh, roughly around um, you know 50 uh, seaters. So they have got the buffet spread here, uh, right starting from the soup and then they have got some papadams. They have got some chutneys and pickles. I think they have got some mm, spinach and you know spaghetti kind of stuff. They have got paneer dupi as a. Okay, so here it has got uh, Kashmiri Damalu. These all are veg. We have got only one non-veg covered in this uh, buffet. They've got something called a gata curry. This gata curry is actually a Rajasthani local cuisine. They've got rajma. They've got some steamed rice to go with uh, rajma dal. Okay, so they also have got ice cream uh, as a dessert portion. And here is a non veg. Okay, so there are two non veg actually. One is egg curry, and the other one is murk shakavati. Uh, not very sure what is murk shakavati. I don't know how it sounds like. So, apart from that, you got the salads buffet here. Um, we have got roughly around six types of salads um, which you can try. So, these are all the things which is covered in the buffet. So, it's pretty good. I mean, for 650 rupees, you are going to have a lot of vegetarian dish. Apart from that, you are going to have uh, two non-vegetarian dish covered as well. If you don't want to go for buffet, if you want to keep yourself very light, then you can definitely go for the a la carte menu. All right, so we are planning to, uh, you know, order from the a la carte menu. Um, just want to keep ourselves a little light, uh, not, not going to go for the buffet. So a la carte menu, we have got almost a lot of dishes. I mean, you have both the veg and non-veg uh, dishes. You have got a lot of, uh, you know, you, you, you have also got not only Indian, you have got um, also the Chinese as well as uh, European dishes. So what I've ordered for the dinner is I've ordered stream rice. I've ordered uh, a couple of uh, you know uh, fulka, which is called as roti, and um, I've ordered also a garlic naan to go with. And as a side dish, I've ordered some egg curries and local Rajasthani prepared um, you know chicken curry. So let's hope for the best. Like you know, let's see like you know how does it taste? Um, it tastes like. Let's see. They've given some papadams um, as a complimentary. I've also ordered a, you know, mojito, a drink, just to see like, you know, how does it taste like, you know, if the mojito drink. Pretty much good, pretty much good. The same like what we get in like, you know, in Chennai. So I'm just waiting for my food. So till then I'm going to sip the mojitos and going to have some papadams. Okay, so I've got my food ordered. So it is on my table now. So let me try. Let me see. So this is a garlic naan which I've ordered. Let's see how it goes with egg curry. This is Rajasthani style egg curry. It's good, spicy, slightly over creamy, but it's good. It tastes really good. I've also ordered 
you know, um, Rajasthani style chicken curry. Uh, they said this is a local cuisine. So, let me try this. Naan is very soft. Mm, yummy. Well cooked chicken, well boiled. Pretty, pretty well cooked. And the curry is spicy and a little bit of tangy taste. It's, it sounds different, but it's, I'm loving it. It's really good. I've also ordered some fulkas. See, normally uh, in north side you get two types of roti. Uh, one is fulka, you need to make sure, very sure, like you know, you ask for roti, and the other one is called as a tandoori roti. So tandoori roti will be a pretty harder one, pretty thicker in size, whereas fulka will be like, you know, very thin and soft. So I normally prefer thin and soft, so I've ordered this. Mm, soft and nice, really good. I'm just waiting for my steam rice to come. And these are papadams. These papadams are homemade papadams in Rajasthan, which is pretty famous. And it's really, really, but it's it's completely different from what you get in South India, actually. Completely oil free. They make it in home and they bake it in the oven, actually. It's not oil fried, they bake it in oven. Crispy and tasty, it's a masala papadam. It's really, tastes nice. So I've got my white rice. This is not basmati. This is something else. This is definitely not poni as well. It's a very long grain rice. I'm going to try this with my um, chicken curry. Let's see. Awesome. I'm loving this chicken curry. It's really going good with the naan as well as with the white rice. It's spicy and good, really good. Mm. Okay, so I'm he here for the dinner. Um, it's too hot, sunny day today. Um, so I just you know, want to make my dinner very, very light. So I'm not opting for buffet. I'm just ordering a la carte. I've just ordered white rice, plain dal and I have ordered a chicken achari tikka. This is a local uh, Rajasthani kusain, uh, in kusain made, you uh, know, uh, the ingredients are made and it's an achari tikka. It smells nice. Loving it. Well cooked chicken. It's very soft. It has it is spicy as well as tangy taste. As I said, it's an achari tikka. It spicy and tangy taste. It's really good. They have given some masala, onions. Mm, awesome. It's actually tangy and spicy. Loving it. It's really really good. It will definitely going to go well with rice and dal. Yummy. The lentils are very good, really good, not spicy. The chicken tikka is spicy and tangy. White rice is soft. The foods are delicious here. They're really, really delicious here. I would definitely recommend the phone um, Rantapur Resort because the food is delicious and what you are getting is value for money. And even if you look into the menu, the price ranges are very, very, very nominal. What you normally get in any of the city in a restaurant. So definitely, yes, if you are coming down. Uh, my favorite two dish which I would definitely want to recommend you is one is Lalmas. 
which I had it for my lunch, absolutely fantastic. The other one is Achari Chicken Tikka. Achari Chicken Tikka is really, really good. It's spicy with tangy taste, wonderful. Okay, so we came here for the buffet breakfast. They've got a decent spread. They've got even the South Indian as well as the North Indian dishes. Let's see what they've got. So we have got all the Kellogg's. Uh, we have got Kellogg's to go with the milk. And we have got some pickles. We've got Italy and Sambar. Okay. We have got Upma as well. We have got bread pakoda. And we've got some mint chutney as well to go with bread pakoda. And we've got aloo onion paratha actually. It's called as alu piyas paratha. We've got kulchas and chole to go with kulchas. And if you would like to go for breads, we've got bread and toaster. We've got jams, butter and honey. Then the beverages, you've got tea, coffee, and you've got a juice as well, cappuccino if you like. You know, you have a cappuccino machine where you can make your own cappuccino. And yes, you have got um, cut fruits, you know, the fruits for the day. As well as you have got uh, lots of uh, three types of fresh juice. One is watermelon, one is orange, and other one is kind of, you know, a milkshake. It's a pretty decent spread, uh, value for money. So let me go ahead and try uh, the dishes and see how it is. So I'm going to try with South Indian, um, so Italy and Samba. Um, yeah, here we got the bowls. You also got chutneys, um, the coconut chutney and pudina chutney as well. So definitely yes, I'm going to try bread pakora. This is one of my favorite actually. Then we have got aloo. Okay. We have got aloo paratha as well as onion paratha separately. So I'm going to try with onion paratha. And some cool cheese. Let me try this first and then I'll go for bread. Not like the South Indian sambar, I mean, sambar is a little sweet actually, but not bad. Um, the Italy is good, Italy is soft. Hmm. Italy is soft, sambar is a little sweet. Let me try this. <clears throat> if you want, I mean this mm, onion paratha goes well with uh, pickles. Mm. Awesome. This is awesome. Onion paratha, fresh, soft, stuffed onions inside. It's actually really, really good. Awesome. Mm. This is chole. Chole is awesome as well. I have ordered some masala omelettes mm, which is in the light, light counter. Yep. To be honest, except the sambar, I am loving everything. Masala kulcha, mm, I mean masala chole is absolutely fantastic. The best part what I like this is the onion paratha. It's very soft um, and the omelette is really good. Masala omelette is really, really good. Yeah. So definitely worthwhile um, and it's a value for money. I mean, like, you know, mm, uh, the uh, breakfast, buffet breakfast comes um, in the package. You know, when you book the room, it comes along with the package. They've got a very pretty decent spread. Um, taste is really good. They've got a lot of cut fruits if you like to take. 
Uh, you've got bread, jams, extras, and all those things. Uh, you've got uh, milkshakes. Uh, um, that is, they've got strawberry milkshake today. Um, sometimes they have uh, vanilla milkshake as well. And um, apart from that, you have got uh, juices. You know, they have got mango juice, orange juice, and also we have they have got uh, pomegranate juice as well. Good and watermelon juice as well. Yeah. So good. What's up, We just came for our lunch now, and after this lunch, we are going to go for the safari in zone one. So I've ordered an a la carte menu. I've ordered, uh, you know, um, plain rice, uh, tawa roti, and today I have ordered. Um, a special um, cuisine which is normally very famous here and it's called as lal mas. Uh, lal mas is nothing but red meat and it's a goat, I mean it's a mutton actually. Um, so that's what I'm going to try. So many uh, people in the restaurant asked me, they requested me to uh, try this dish which is lal mas. So let me just try how it is. The texture looks really appealing. It looks like too much of oil and masala. So let's see how it goes. I've got some papadam as well. Mm. Absolutely yummy. Very, very, very tasty. Thank you. It's really yummy. Well cooked mutton. Mutton is very very soft. As we get in like in biryani, the mutton is very soft. It's very tender. Taste is awesome. I would definitely recommend if you are staying in the phone um, hotel, phone resort in Ranatampur, please do try the dish. Lalmas is absolutely fantastic. I'm going to try how it goes with tawa roti. So let me try. Mm. It's actually going really, really good with the white rice as well as with the tawa roti. Wonderful. Dal roti. Nice. I definitely recommend. Please try lal mas if you are staying in for and run the Thank you. So. The, actually, the dishes are really, really good. Um, I've ordered a sample of a lot of dishes, you know, what they've got in the a la carte menu. But if you want to go for a buffet, you can go for a buffet. Um, it is price worthy, I would say. You anyway get two non veg dishes and a lot of veg dishes with salads, desserts, ice creams, as well as gulab jamul. Okay. Um, so it's up to you. I mean, like if you want to go uh, for a heavy, then you can go for a buffet. If not, you can order a la carte. It's up to you. Um, tastes are really good, Emmy.